IMPD is set to launch an internal diversity and inclusion council later this month. More than two dozen officers will help examine how the department treats its staff and how it can better represent the community. Protests last spring in part targeted IMPD actions. Other community leaders say police deserve some credit for new de-escalation and implicit bias training and for creating more civilian oversight. They're hoping more community input is having an impact on the department. When you think about the work that IMPD is doing, if you are close to IMPD, then you're aware of things that they're doing. And so you see them at work. I don't know that um, they're getting enough credit, but at the same time, they still have a lot of work to do. IMPD says more plans for training, mentoring, and promotions are now in the works as well.